Now another kind of problem, and it looks like a very interesting one. Mary Jones is dialing up for what appears to be a heavy date, and if it's okay, we'll butt in for a few minutes and see what's going on. Well, what's this? Checking up? Working from diagrams? Following instructions? Absolutely. Scientific art of beauty. The latest from Loveliness Laboratories. Research to the rescue, helping Mary emphasize all the nice things in her very nice face, showing her how to minimize certain features, how to accent others. Lady science has done all right by you. You sure look swell. Uh-oh, now she's gone and ruined everything. But beauty science could have helped her here, too. Let's go to beauty headquarters. Yes, Hollywood. And meet famous Paramount makeup man, Eddie Sims, who thinks that glasses like hairdos can flatter the features. That just like eyebrow and lip lines, the lines of one's glasses can bring out good points, make bad points inconspicuous. When an actress's role calls for specs, it's just part of the normal makeup problem to Eddie, and the way he's solved this problem can be of tremendous value to the 10 million American women outside of Hollywood who have to wear glasses, not to play in pictures, but because of eyesight. Eddie's drawings give you the lowdown based on two fundamental types of faces, the round face and the long face. First, the hair. High and close for the round face, but low and wide for the long face. Lipstick next. Applied as much up and down as possible on the round face, but the long face needs horizontal lines like this. Now for the eyeglasses. For the round face, an arched bridge and a dropped lower curve to help correct that circular appearance. The long face needs just the opposite, an almost flattened upper edge and lenses with wide, shallow curves. Now, if you don't believe that these added lines are effective, watch closely while we switch hairdos, lip shape, and eyeglasses from one face to another. As you see them now, they're okay, but wait. There, the shape of the face is the same, but how differently it looks with wrong makeup and glasses. Let's put everything back. There, much better, in fact, perfect. Still don't like your old specs, Mary? Neither do we, take them off. They're not right for your face. But these are a set of three, for just as a woman varies her wardrobe for different occasions, so can she find exciting variations in her glasses. These for formal wear. These for sports, same lens but tinted. And these for informal day wear, fitting right into the pretty picture that's Mary's face. That's all.